In this video, you're going to learn how to turn rows of data into columns and columns of data into rows in Excel using the copy paste special transpose tool. And I'll also show you how to do the same thing using shortcut keys. And if you'd like to grab a copy of the Excel file I use in this video, just click on the link in the description below. Okay, so on this worksheet, you can see that I've got the numbers one to five in a column over in column A there and also one to five and then six to 10 in these two columns over here. And what I'm gonna do is show you a few ways that you can copy that and paste it into rows of data and then get those rows and paste them into columns again. And you do that by using paste special transpose and I'll show you a few different ways to do that, including the shortcut keys. All right, so let's get started with the first example. So if I come over here and I just highlight the numbers one to five, and then I right click on my mouse and choose copy. And then I just come up here to cell C3, right click again, and then come down to the paste options. There's one here called transpose. And if I click on that, you can see that it's taken that entire column of numbers one to five with all the formatting including the background color and the center alignment, and it's pasted them as a row. Okay, so that's a nice easy example of how to use paste special transpose to turn a column of numbers or any other data into a row. Okay, I'm gonna show you now how to get the row. So if I just highlight that and turn it into a column, and we'll do it a different way this time, we'll go up to the home tab in the ribbon and we'll click on copy. And then we'll come over here and choose our destination cell. And then we'll go back up to the home tab in the ribbon and click on the paste drop down. And you can see we've got transpose just here. So we'll click on that. Okay, so now we've turned that row of data from C3 to G3 into a column. Okay, so that's how you can do it for one column of data or one row of data. What if you've got multiple columns or rows? Well, we can do that down here. So let's select these two columns of data here. And this time let's use the shortcut keys. So we'll press Control C to copy and we'll come up to our destination cell and then we'll press Control Alt V and that brings up our paste special box. Now there's two ways you can choose transpose here. The first way is to just check the box there for transpose with the mouse. So I'll just uncheck that. And the second way is to press on the E key on your keyboard, which I just did. And that also checks the transpose box. Once you've checked the box using either method, just click on okay. And as you can see, that's copied the two columns of data and it's pasted it as two rows. So let's just highlight all that. And we'll just use the right click this time to copy. And then we'll come over and choose a destination cell and right click. This time let's actually click on paste special. And once again, it brings up the paste special box and we can just select transpose press OK, and that's pasted those two rows of data into two columns. Okay, so that's how you can switch your columns of data to rows and your rows of data to columns.